right? So today I've got a really unique system that we just got done installing. And so I'll kind of preface this by taking a little walk around. Um, we have this huge basement down here. And believe it or not, this was or is manufactured homes on top and its basement down below. And so what used to be here was a typical, none of this was here at all. Uh, this was typical manufactured home furnace up there. So there used to be a furnace up on the second story and its supply air came down and it was just a giant flex duct monster. And we changed all that. So now we used that existing hole for our upstairs return and we have got a zoned dual fuel heat pump gas furnace system. So inside we've got a carrier two-stage furnace and outside we have a Bosch five-ton heat pump. Um, that's also two-stage in this application. And we've got the cool thing here, zoning. So this zone panel is controlling these dampers. So there's one here. And there's one here. And each of these dampers is controlling a run of ductwork. So this one right here, one big long duct that we installed, all hard pipe, rectangular duct. This entire trunk is feeding the upstairs. So every branch run that we see coming off of this, which by the way, these guys did absolutely amazing work. Every single branch run is steel. There's no flex in this entire system. That's all feeding the upstairs. Now, this trunk over here that runs back, this all feeds the downstairs. And downstairs, we have these nice, they happen to have T-grids. We have T-grid four-way diffusers. We've got four of them. We've got our return all the way back there to draw the air back. And then in this side room, we have got nice big, 950 diffusers that are blowing all the air this way in this room. This room is less of a priority than these over here, but this is still going to heat wonderfully. Um, so anyway, this is a pretty unique situation. You've got a big basement, and you've got an upstairs, and they're going to heat and cool at different rates. And that's why zoning is super cool. We can have a thermostat downstairs controlling this entire downstairs environment to whatever temperature and we can control the upstairs. So if they're, they wanna come down here and use this and turn it up to 70, they, they certainly can, but they can also leave it at 60 whenever they're not down here. Um, this system, this is a very complicated system. This is not a system that you can just throw in onto existing ductwork. All of this had to be designed from scratch. Every piece of sheet metal, um, positioning of those dampers, all the duct runs, very, very complicated system to design and install. And this is working really, really well. They're gonna be really, really happy with it. But yeah, this is not something that we, you, you risk a lot of things throwing this onto an existing duct system if the duct work is not sized appropriately. This one, we know for a fact it's sized appropriately because we did all the math. Um, and then down here, we've got a nice big Honeywell five inch media filter. Keep down on our static pressure. Got a five ton carrier up on a riser there. In the back here, we've got our bypass. And before I leave, we'll likely get a video of that Bosch outdoor unit doing its thing, but just beautiful work here beautiful work here's that Bosch five ton outdoor unit need to do a little trim around these hedges we don't want these growing too close to the unit so we'll take care of that that's it running can barely hear it from over here up on risers a nice pad that's it.